Well, I was raised in a Christian family, um, was brought up going to church and was very blessed in that way. I was going to go study overseas and so before going away I was um, having a get together with some friends and one friend had a really serious motorbike accident that I was the first to the scene to. Um, and it was quite traumatic. And then while I was overseas studying, I got the news that one of my best friends at the time um, was suffering with a sudden brain tumour. Within two weeks of getting the brain tumour, she passed. I've, I've always just been so sure that that's gonna be fine because God can heal that and like she's a Christian, you know, like she's got such an amazing life ahead of her and she was still taken from us and I didn't understand why I was miserable about it all and just shut down to everyone around me but also to God. In the meantime of um, being overseas I had met somebody and that developed um, into eventually being engaged and I decided to go for that instead of fixing all of these things over here and diving into my relationship with God more um, through all of this grief. I, I went to somebody else instead um, who wasn't necessarily the right person to walk through that with. The chronic fatigue was so hard to manage. I was almost diagnosed with depression because it was really hard for me to make it to classes. I was letting people down, not being able to fulfill commitments that I'd signed up to and getting to a point where I was fainting. And by the time I came home, I was five months bedridden because I'd pushed it so far. The pressure that my relationship was under as well then I also ended up shutting out my family. I've shut out God so far, I've shut out friends that I've grown up with, and now because of this one relationship that I was trying to make work, I was gonna shut out my family too. It, it ended up not working out and we had to um, originally postpone the engagement and um, it eventuated into calling off the wedding and the relationship altogether dealing with it internally um, started to just have a really negative effect on how I was seeing um, who I was or my purpose. I had a, a friend reach out to me from Curate and say that she was starting up a girls small group through conversations and meeting together like that. Um, so much was starting to heal but in the meantime a relationship in particular going forward I suffered uh, various forms of like abuse in that relationship because of not knowing who I was anymore until I did just meet with my small group leader one-on-one -on -one. she brought me back into these pillars that I had abandoned I got out of that relationship and I got back involved in church and um, my relationship with God grew through me just knowing that his presence in my in my life was this huge gap that was missing and I just kept getting more and more involved until it was suddenly this really healthy community and family around me. God restored every every little part, any um, Thing that might have tried to be robbed or taken away in the past, um, like losing friends. I now have great friends and two small groups because, like, I just am loving the people that I'm around and getting so much out of doing life together. I'm recently married to an incredible, beautiful man. My family relationships have been restored. I'm singing again. I honestly can say now that. I'm still working on it, but I know my limits and I have set boundaries and I have a healthier um, lifestyle and way of living now. I know that God has restored every little part of my life and undeservingly given me life and fullness.